on Saturday night, the middleweight title was on the line as UFC 117 took place at the Oracle Arena in Oakland, California. In the main event, champion Anderson Silva looked to defend his title for a remarkable seventh time when he faced trash-talking Team Quest standout Chael Sonnen. Sonnen used a perfect game plan as he was able to control the Brazilian, forcing him to fight from his back. Sonnen showcased an improved striking game, landing some shots on the Team Black House fighter before securing the takedown. Over the next five rounds, the Oregon native relentlessly attacked from the top, executing flawless ground and pound on one of the pound-for-pound -pound best. Although Silva tried to fish for submissions, Sonnen exhibited solid defense in addition to his toughness and crushing pressure. At the 310 mark of the fifth and final round, with the title slipping from his grasp, Anderson Silva threw up a Hail Mary triangle attempt and was awarded as Sonnen was forced to tap or nap. In a spectacular main event, Anderson Silva retains his title in the hardest fight of his career. Two of the best welterweights battled it out as rugged John Fitch met ATT Muay Thai monster Thiago Alves, who came in a half a pound overweight and was fined 20% of his purse. From the opening, the AKA standout Fitch set a pace that the Brazilian could not keep up with. The former Purdue wrestler used his grappling abilities to wear Alves out and beat on him from the top with suffocating control. The weight cut seemed to be an issue as Alves did not seem as explosive or powerful as he's been in the past. In the second, the 26-year-old did show some signs of life, but Fitch drained it, taking Alves down again and using his superior top game. In the end, it would be the workhorse John Fitch getting the unanimous decision victory in another welterweight tilt, former 170-pound King Matt Hughes faced off against Henzo Gracie black belt Ricardo Almeida. Hughes avoided the ground battle and instead wanted to impress with his evolving striking, but Almeida seemed too fast for the Illinois native. Hughes did land a big shot on Almeida who went crashing to the canvas and was caught off guard by the submission game of the hit squad captain and was choked unconscious with a modified arm triangle. Clay Guida looked great as he put the pressure on future star Rafael Dos Anjos as the two locked horns in a lightweight matchup. In the third round, Guida controlled from the top and put pressure on the jaw of Dos Anjos who injured it earlier in the fight and was forced to tap out due to injury. In the first fight on the main card, heavyweight sensation Junior Dos Santos squared off against Ultimate Fighter winner Roy Nelson in a bout that can only be described as a one-sided beating. Nelson tried his best to take out the BJJ brown belt, but Dos Santos' big striking and big power was too much for big country to handle. After three rounds of action, Junior Dos Santos wins by unanimous decision on scores of 30-26 and 30-27 twice.